How's it going guys? Today is another move out day. I know, I'm not sure when this vlog will be posted, but sometime last year, I was going into my first year of uni. I went into a foundation year, which is a four year course. So I have completed that and through the summer of 2024 this year, I moved back in home with my mother to stay there for the summer as the accommodation I was in at the moment, or the accommodation I was in last year didn't allow students to stay over summer and I didn't want to stay in one of the shit ones. So I moved back home, but now today is another day and we are moving back into town, which is much easier for myself because I'm A, I'm close to the university and B, I'm just close to town in general. So it'll be easy to get around and stuff. Close to the gym, close to home, close, you know, it's just easier for me. Everything is all in the middle kind of thing. But this is cleared out a bit. I know I haven't done much video since the summer. A, because the Wi-Fi has not been good. And B, well, I just haven't had the time and I procrastinate a lot. So, but I do have content coming on the way. So just be patient with that. And I will let you know as soon as I have my updates and stuff. But uh, yeah, I'm, I've packed some stuff in boxes and all that. This is a mess. I'm sorry that you have to see that, but yeah. This will be a start to a new adventure. This will be a a kind of moving out, moving in, tour around the house that I'll be living in kind of vlog. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this kind of stuff. And as you can see, I do have boxes here and I've got a couple more. I haven't finished packing. I should have done ages ago really, because I am packing the day I move in. So yeah, another box here. No doubt I'll have to fill up more boxes or bags or shit like that. If you guys are happy for me to be back vlogging and you want me to do more vlogs, maybe a day in life university edition or something like that, just drop a like on this video and maybe drop a comment down below what else you want me to see. What what else you want me? What what else you want me to do or whatever you want to see me do? Anything like that, just drop a comment down below. Share this vlog. Share my channel. Tell people to subscribe. Tell people that Walker is back making videos. He is back, back again. So yeah, make sure you guys click like button, click subscribe and the bell next to subscribe. And let's get into the rest of this video. Enjoy. I think that's pretty much everything packed for, well, at least 95% of everything or 90%. The rest is just potentially my desk, my PC, my monitors and my chair. Pretty much 90 to 95% of everything's packed. What I need to do now is actually go to town and go and do my university registration. Because I do need to do that today. And I'm always one to do stuff at last minute. So I guess I gotta go to town, cycle there on my lecky bike because I can't drive yet. And then the moving process will begin. So uh, yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Come on, let me ride your bicycle. It's up and down the call, like a bicycle. Yeah. And you can see sheep. Look at them. Barbara Mary. <laughs> uh, I do love the bike ride, special ride. Great trail, night town. See that when it's sunny. Maybe not so wet or raining. But you know, it's just a bit damp. Nothing like this bike cannot handle. But yeah, right. We're picking up speed, picking up speed to go to the hub to register. Okay, so a bit of a switch from last time where I was in the uh, shoe club. On that day, I could not get it sorted, but I went the next day, managed to get it sorted kind of, had to email the department with advice and help about choosing modules and stuff, so get that done. I also, I'm not fully moved in now, so I'll have to give you guys a little tour of the place but right now. I need to go to Morrison's and do a bunch of shit. So off to Morrison's, pick up a prescription and go to like home bargains or something because I need to get some cleaning stuff and just some other bits and pieces that normal people get when they're moving in. All right, that is the prescription all picked up and now I'm outside, son of cycles. 
need to take this in because I, when I'm riding it, the chain makes a clunky sound whenever I change gear. And it doesn't sound very healthy, so yeah, I might have to fork out just a little bit of money just to get a new chain. Hopefully it's not too much. My guess is 40 quid. We'll see now. Not truly ideal. Uh, I have to drop in on Friday. I'm gonna get a new chain, new brake pads apparently. And I think that's about it. But it's gonna cost 90 quid. Oh well, it could be worse, it could be expensive, but yeah. These things have to be done. As long as I don't hear that bloody clunking sound again, I will be happy. <laughs> right, after the bargains, let's get some kitchen stuff, cleaning stuff, just more important garden stuff. Very successful home bargain trip. Well, some of it went on the floor, but you know, got all the stuff I need for the house. Mouthwash. Fucking, what's it called? Washing machine capsules. This dish thing. Toilet color fresh smell thing. Fairly liquid. Let me pick up. Well, I need to spray because I ran out. And also, these things, so your bathroom doesn't smell. And also some air frying liners, because, well, we haven't got a dishwasher in here. And I thought, you know what, it's going to be much easier for me to just clean that rather than clean my air frying. Oh, and i got another one of them. And just an elbow grease scrubbing pad. Because those are the essentials you need in a kitchen slash bathroom and toilet. Yeah, cool. But I forgot one thing. Spray to wipe for the, for the um, countertops. I forgot that thing. Got anything else? Just not that. Oh, and kitchen roll. Got that too. But yeah, that was fun. And oh, a what the fuck are they called? Washing up basket thing. One of them. Got one of them. All sorted. So I don't have to leave any clothes anywhere on the floor because, well, I don't look like a fucking scruff. But yes, very good. Very nice. Sorted. Once everything is all done, all sorted, I will give you guys a tour of the whole house but right now because here we're going to have like an overhead fan kind of thing for the hobs and that hasn't been done yet and also well this is one of the toilets and this is one of the fridges yes it's in front of the um door kind of blocked it and i'll tell you for why like uncle Bryn says, well you know these plugs here they don't work yet they don't work. So, yeah, this, this fridge, no light on it. Try to turn it off and turn it back on again, the old, that old way. But, you know, I've had to plug it in here. You can see the lights on. But I had to plug it in. I had to plug it in there. Which is a very strange place for a plug to go. But, you know, it makes the fridge work. So, happy days. Fucking hell, sat here eating a biscuit. There's a fucking pigeon. Ah, he's fucked. He's fucked off. Ah, boring. So currently sat in work. Um, I haven't been able to do a tour of the house yet because right now we're getting like the overhood of the cooker fitted in. So once that's done, then I can give you a tour of the whole place. We've had, had handles put on the door because you can't really like close them properly or easily. So that's helpful. Um, I think that's all I need to do. So once that's all done, all tidied up, all done, I will give you a tour of like the main parts of the house and of course my room and all that you know so make sure you guys stay tuned make sure you're clicking that like button make sure you subscribe and sharing this video with everyone you know because you know we need to hit more subscribers get more views and all that and i'll create more content so let's go this year is the year all right guys pretty much everything now is all done for the house the part that i mentioned in the kitchen that's been sorted so Let's give you guys a proper tour of the house now, shall we? And also, look at the view. Well, not view, but like, you know, there's a lot of cars coming up and down this hill every single day. So, never mind about that. Let's just get into the house. And here we have the living room, the lounge, the front room, whatever you guys call it, this is what it is. I will pick you guys up and like, you know, do a bit of a twirl, a 360 round, 180, whatever, so you guys can actually see it properly. I'm not just from where you are right now.
Okay, so that, that's the door as you like walk in, and obviously that was the sofa that I was sat on. And we've got a nice little bench bit here for, you know, when you have like your food or something or whatever. Nice few bottles here. Not mine, but I'm jealous that they're empty, but I should get some. Another, another sofa here, nice little table, and a nice little lamp in the corner here. Nice TV, got that all sorted, and some space for storage. And you know, you can just people watch out this window, which can be quite fun. Or pigeon watch, because there's loads of pigeons here. Literally, there's a woman next door, I think she's number 10. Uh, all the pigeons hang out there because, well, she just feeds the pigeons all the time, and there's about 10 million thousands of them there every single day. I see them outside my, um, my window, but I like to just knock on the window and scare them. And here is the kitchen, the place for cooking. Yep, so like you guys saw, this bit had not been installed yet or complete or finished. So yeah, finally got this done. Looks nice, very smart. Very fingerprinty though, but you know, that's fine. That's fine. It looks cool, it looks smart, it looks very modern, so that's okay. So yeah, you got your, um, got your tap and stuff there, washing machine, and you know, things for washing up. That's my washing up that I should have done yesterday, but I was in work, so yeah. <laughs> A nice window, and to watch over at next door to see if they do anything fun or funny. And got, got a microwave here, and it was a strange looking microwave, and boom, that's how, that's how you open it. That's cool. And you got your oven and cooker and stuff like that, toaster, kettle, loads of other stuff. This stuff isn't mine, but this mine, 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 and keep all my glasses and shit in there. And, you know, a little cutlery drawer, plates and all that. And then, got some of my food, cereals, snacks, hot chocolates, bread, rice, whatever. I haven't got loads of stuff yet, but you know, we'll cross the bridge once we get to it. Also, some XAX vodka, you know, for incoming uh, parties or house parties or sessions even. A blender, in case I ever want to make a smoothie or feeling healthy for going to the gym or and all that, you know. That's a goal of mine, to try and get healthy. Not that I'm not healthy at the moment but I could just make improvements to how I eat, which I have done, but I kind of just lost track of it a little bit. But, eh, oh well, we, we'll saw it, it's fine, it's fine. And we have our fridges, double fridges. That's my bottle opener. Is anyone, has anyone got anything in this fridge? Nobody's put anything in this fridge yet. What about the freezer? Nobody's put anything in the freezer yet. Well, I guess it's just me. Okay, maybe it's not just me. There, there is a few more stuff in there. Yep, nice fridge. You got a lot of room for things and all that, you know. Banging, banging, banging. Okay, comment down below. Orange juice or apple juice? The fucking answer is apple juice. <laughs> and obviously, we got the freezer. Plenty of room for plenty of food to feed yourself and the house and whatnot. And here is one of our bathrooms slash with a shower in it. Yeah, sink, toilet, shower, uh, radiator, toilet roll, toilet roll. I'm not sure why there's not a toilet roll holder thing, but who knows, who knows? At least there's toilet roll in here, okay? We've also got a little outdoorsy bit, I mean, it's not like, it's not a garden or anything, it's more like an outside yard kind of thing. It's alright, I mean, for any smokers that I live with, they can just come out here and have a cig. Bin for things. Uh, there is like a shed, but, um, well, you know, l look at that. Creepy, strange, lots of cobwebs. So there's probably spiders galore. If I was to ever make like a sketchy kind of song or like a dark kind of song or whatever, I think if I was to do a music video for it, I would film it in here. Cause I reckon that could work. Get some lights in here or well, use some lights and you know, you got yourself quite a edgy looking music video. 
and got just like another room kind of I, I'm not sure what this is I'm not sure I don't know it's just yeah you, do, you, you don't need to see any more you don't need to see any more than that that's fine and I shall take you up the steps got a little gardening-ish bit there yeah nothing too exciting so we'll just get back to the fun stuff and now I'll just show you guys uh, the my bedroom and the two bathrooms or slash shower rooms that we have. You guys have seen the most exciting things so far. So upstairs we bathroom number one. It's just a small room with a toilet and a sink in it. Don't need to do any showing around about that, but you know, there you go. You know, go for a piss, shit, sorted. And then the other shower room, got the shower behind me there. Got a mirror over there, it's got a towel on it, I'm not sure why. Maybe to stop it from steaming up or whatever, I don't know. And you know, got another sink. Oh, I don't know why. And we got another and we got another sink down there, another radiator, you know, window, all that. Cool beans, cool. Yeah, the water pressure needs sorted on that, on like the taps and showers and stuff. So hopefully that will get sorted soon. I had a shower today for the first time. And yeah, it was like I was just getting drizzled on, so. <laughs> also, I reckon it could have easily fit a toilet in here. Maybe. Maybe if that sink was there, and then the toilet was there, that could have worked. But maybe there was a certain way and you weren't able to do it. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know these things. But anyway, let's get on to the final bit. All right, so here is the bedroom, we got one cupboard, we have a mirror, that's the door, <laughs> and we got another cupboard just here, a little, well, I could, kind of like a little fiery place looking kind of thing, you know, not much going on there, just a bit of storage, you know, yeah, another cupboard, put the TV there, got a nice little desk, which, by the way, before anyone says, where's your PC and your monitor and all your setup? Wi-Fi is not till the 8th of October, so I thought, well, there's no point in bringing it if I can't use it yet. So, as of right now, I've just got my MacBook, well, that lamp was already there, and just a couple other bits, you know. Uh, snack drawer, and some more storage for some more shit. Many hats. You know, the Master Chief came with me, so did Pac-Man, so did Del Boy, and so did the dubbed version of Elwood from the Blues Brothers. <laughs> and yeah, got my hats there, and a nice king-size bed. It is so comfortable, and you know, even I feel small in that bed, and I'm six foot three. So overall, I think that kind of concludes the whole tour of the house slash moving in, and all of that jazz, you know, I think that is everything. I've shown you everything that I needed to share you and showed you everything I wanted to share you. So if you guys enjoyed this vlog, make sure you click the like button. Make sure you're subscribing, because I know there is a percentage of you guys that aren't actually subscribed to my channel. And there's going to be more content coming this year, especially with I'm going into my first year in actual film and TV. So I'll be doing little behind the scenes maybe of... Um, my projects and if I'm making short films I'll do behind the scenes of that too so there'll be a lot of opportunities for different kind of vlogs different kind of videos to post on the channel so yeah make sure you guys are subscribing make sure you guys are letting make sure you guys are letting everyone know that I'm back for good this year so yeah subscribe click like button make sure you ding dong that notification bell because I can't stress enough Every time I upload a video, if that bell is turned on, you'll get notified straight away. Uh, you can click it and watch it and enjoy it. But yeah, that's everything, I think. If I've missed anything, then you can always follow my Instagram page. I've always got updates, always posting regularly on there as well. I'll post about the house, post about what I do on my days, post about uni and all that, so yeah, 
my Instagram will be down in the description below. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter for the latest updates of my channel and live streams, because I will be back doing live streams as well. I'll be playing games like Black Ops 6 when it's out. I'll be doing Fortnite, Fall Guys, everything in between. Let me know what you guys want me to see. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Whenever it is, whatever it is, peace out. If you see me at the time, see me at the time, dancing with the stars, I let